or hi. Augsburg, the university city in the southwest of the Free State Bavaria, the capital of Swabia. The city is considered the most ancient in modern Germany. Germany. After Trier. With the population in card inhabitants is the third largest city in the Bavarian state. After Munich and Nuremberg. Large scientific and industrial center. In 1997 it was called the most green city in a competition in which nine European states and the countries participated. The name of the city comes from the first name of the city Augusta Vindelicarum which was based after occupation of the Swabian lands as the military camp the Druze and Tiberi by order of the ancient Roman Emperor Augustus in the 15th year to end. Subsequently the city became the center of the Roman province of Rishon and within the next 400 years of the Roman dominion actively developed and prospered. Augsburg is located on the Lech and Vertic rivers. The old town and its southern areas are located in the north of the bottom of a high ledge which arose between the abrupt hilly area of Freiburg and the east and a high isthmus in the west. Augsburg borders on National Park Augsburg, the western woods. Besides, the city is rich with green plantings, for this reason Augsburg in 1997 received the European award, the most live and green city. The city is the largest owner of the woods in Bavaria. Augsburg is called the city of three rivers. It is about Lake Vertic and Zingolda. Lech, the main river, Vertic, Lech's inflow, Zingold flows from East Allgäu and in Augsburg falls into the system of artificial canals and local streams. From the east the district take Hochfriedberg, in the west the Augsburg district borders on Augsburg. Thanks to the form of the city extended from the north on the south, there are a lot of cities and municipal units border on Augsburg on the parties of a peculiar corridor. Agglomeration of Augsburg goes clockwise since the east as follows. Friedberg District A. Koch Friedberg Kainigsbrunn, Stettbergen, Neuses, Gersthofen all the Augsburg district. All their main settlements directly adjoin to the built-up areas of Augsburg. Besides, municipalities of Reeling, Affing, Kissing, Mooring and Merking. All the district take Hock Friedberg. And also Bobingen, Gesetzthausen and Didorf border on Augsburg. All the Augsburg district. The square of Augsburg in administrative borders minus 147 came. Houses occupy only a quarter of this territory and together with adjacent free zones. Development of the inhabited sector is planned at the expense of 200 hectares of conversion territories where there is already expensive infrastructure. A third of the administrative territory of Augsburg is occupied by agricultural grounds, a quarter of the woods. 78 kilometers, the extent of city borders. 23 kilometers from the north on the south and 14.5 kilometers from the west on the east. 19 kilometers, like a current extent within the city, 13 vertic, 6 zingolda. Since 1972 when during administrative reform administrative borders of Augsburg included adjacent territories, Augsburg began to treat the most green of the big cities of Germany. 
in the southeast of the city, the city forest of 21 square kilometer, not only the favorite venue of rest and leisure of citizens, but also the major nature protection zone is located. The southwest of the urban area, a part of other nature protection zone. It is the natural park, Augsburg Western Forests. The zone has the area of 1.175 km. Also is the largest in the Bavarian Swabia. In the north it borders on Danube, in the east on Vertex Valley, in the west on Mindel, in the south with Lower Algo. Augsburg, the city of channels. Once need for water mills and weavers shops forced to dig them in a large number. Most of all channels on let minus 29. Total length. 77 kilometers. On vertic only 4. Total length. 11 kilometers. Total length of all channels in Augsburg minus 90 kilometers. 45 kilometers, the extent of 19 streams flowing in Augsburg. Two are distinguished from channels of Augsburg. Faber Canal into which Singold and Sankobek in the north of the city falls. Both of these channels fall as a result into Vertic and Faber Canal B-sides and flows parallel to Vertic. The streams proceeding in Augsburg represent a complex water system. At Hockeblast two water streams. Hauptstadtbeck and Neubach are divided by Lech, but through several hundreds of meters connect again and fall in the north into Herrenbeck. Altogether, in turn, they feed Proviantbach with his inflows. Hanreibeck and Fichtelbeck and also flowing on Kofbeck West. Kofbeck feeds Schaffelbeck and Stadgraben and Innenstadt Canal channels which connect then in the north of the city at Uppenkimmen. Start back in the west of the city at Wolfsano connects to Proviantbach again, and at Vertex Marv falls in Lech. Through Fersi Mulbach flows. Brandenbeck flows through Stadtwald, being divided then into a set of small streams and before an end to connecting in one stream again. Augsburg is in a transitional zone between a humid climate of Atlantic and an arid continental climate of the Valley of Lech. Other important factors are the Alps and Danube. Taking into account action of all these factors, weather is rather unstable. Weather periods. Moderate and not too cold winter and warm, but not too hot summer. The snow protecting vegetation in the winter drops out in January and remains to the middle of March. The main amount of precipitation drops out at the beginning of summer. The long droughty periods happen in the summer and in the early fall. Modern Augsburg, the third most populated city of Bavaria. After Munich and Nuremberg. For the beginning of 2008 card people lived in the city. Some more thousand specified Augsburg as the second most important place of the residents. An official share of foreigners among residents of Augsburg minus 16%. It is both about residents with foreign passports and about those someone obtained the German citizenship. The population of Augsburg grows old. For 2005-2008 the number of young people from 16 to 25 years in the city dropped by 9% and number of elderly, 60 years or more senior, on the contrary, grew by 19%. 
from card residents of Augsburg pay obligatory insurance premiums of card people. It doesn't mean that in the city as much of taxpayers as among these card there are unemployed for whom insurance premiums are brought by the state, and there are no businessmen who aren't obliged to pay insurance premiums, but at the same time paying taxes. Unemployment rate is approximately equal in Augsburg to the all-German indicator, but is twice higher than on average in Bavaria. These are specifics of big cities with high percent not of indigenous people. At the same time, two Augsburg from other settlements come to work of nearly 65000 people. From the area Augsburg minus 33000, from the area Achalk Friedberg minus 13000, from the government district of Upper Bavaria minus 600, from Munich minus 1700. From Augsburg to other cities go to work of 29000 people, from them to Munich minus 6500. By assessment for December 31, 2015 Augsburg makes the population of the inter-district city. City community. 286,374 people. In Augsburg, 36106 of houses. Win. Car departments are the share of card residents of Augsburg. At the same time, city statistics doesn't allocate one room apartments in separate category, uniting them with two room in one category in 17000 apartments. The ancient Bavarian city of Augsburg located near Munich. Approximately in 40 minutes by train. Is well known not only the respectable age. Though his age also really deserves respect. The city was founded by Romans in the 15th year BB. In the Middle Ages, Augsburg was one of the largest trade financial centers of Europe, besides, with the status of the free imperial city of the Sacred Roman Empire of the German nation. In 1806, during Napoleonic reorganization of Europe, Augsburg lost the status of the free city and was included in structure of the Bavarian Kingdom. From medieval times, times of blossoming of Augsburg, the general style of the historic center of the city and the most significant architectural constructions remained. Magnificent town hall and tower perlicurm, cathedrals, parts of city strengthenings. Blossoming fell on the first half of the 17th century, the Augsburg merchants were one of the richest in Europe, and the emperor of the sacred Roman Empire Maximilian I even began to call the mayor of Augsburg because of his frequent visits to the city. The construction of monumental fountains on central squares and until now decorating the city belongs to the same historical period. By the way, Augsburg is proud also of the fact that his merchants invested huge amounts of money not only in the real estate, but also on the charitable purposes. For example, at the expense of the merchant Jacob Fogger, the whole well-planned quarter Foggery was built of 53 houses for people hard-working and decent, but by misfortune fallen into poverty in which for accommodation the symbolical payment was raised. One Rhine gold in a year. As well as the majority of more or less large German cities, Augsburg strongly bombed 1944-45 years. Generally bombed three areas. The North. The Tank Plant Man. The South. Messerschmitt Plant. And the Center. The repair shops of military equipment located in cellars of houses. The largest raid was at the end of February, 1944. Then the blow to the city was struck by over 500 planes of allies. 
British bomb dissenter, and the Americans who had heavy bombers, munitions factories in the north and the south of the city. The majority of architectural monuments died. Decades of recovery work were necessary to return at least a part of lost. On Christmas of 2016 in the downtown the Multiton unexploded bomb of times of World War II was found. Before her elimination for several days the museums, many shops and restaurants were closed, actions are cancelled. Residents and lodges of hotels of adjacent areas were temporarily evacuated. In the 15th century Augsburg became one of the most known centers of jewelry art of Europe. In Germany only masters from Saxony and Schleswig competed to Augsburg. If to speak about the German style distinguishing the nation from other people of Europe, then in this case it is about very skillful use of decorative opportunities of material, including gilding of silver products and an engraving. The German Baroque differed in such richness of expressive forms which closely adjoined to excesses. Therefore the Augsburg style is estimated differently. Nevertheless products of jewelers of Augsburg are in meetings of treasures of all main present and former dynasties of Europe, including a treasury of the Moscow Kremlin. Till the pious woman who voluntarily decided to live together for the sake of God lodged in the 13th century in Lecretel, A.M. Schwal. They called themselves Sisters of Voluntary Poverty. But it still was not the monastery. There wasn't enough church jurisdiction and the room for the device of normal monastic life. The monastery appeared for about 100 years later, in 1335, when the Augsburg clergyman Berthold Ram presented to pious women the big house and recognized their cohabitation as corresponding to the Charter of Church. In 50 years of nuns declared belonging to a Dominican award because the monastery Saint of Magdalena of male Dominicans was just near nuns. at the beginning of the 16th century of the Nun of Street. Ursula Dominicanisches Fraunlben received a gift from an award. New buildings of the monastery and monastic church in style of late Gothic. But the Reformation began, and in 1537 nuns were forced to move to the city of Dillingen, to the Episcopal residence. And ten years' progress of a Catholic Counter-Reformation allowed them to return to Augsburg. Now under reliable protection of the Archbishop. At the beginning of the 18th century a part of monastic constructions was reconstructed in the spirit of Baroque. There lived then in the monastery only two dozen sisters. They looked after sick women, free of charge conducted occupations for girls in Ulrich Seattle and earned means of livelihood by a skillful embroidery and sewing. In 1802 the monastery was transferred to the state. The nuns living there acquired the right to remain for life in the building of the monastery, but reception of new nuns was stopped. When in 1806 Augsburg lost independence, the government of Bavaria revived the monastery. However, reception of new novices began only in 1828, and constructions of the monastery continued to belong to the state. Only at the very end of the 19th century of church it was succeeded to redeem from Bavaria the monastery back. In 1944 the church of the monastery was almost completely destroyed during bombing of Augsburg. It was long restored after war, and restored as a result in the simplified forms. The history of the monastery ended in 1975. 
then the church management left from what was only real school for girls. There are 560 school girls study now. It was the smallest and strangest monastery in Augsburg though with the official version he had everything as it should be. Establishment of Third Award of Franciscans. The last on Imogen's time from the Augsburg Monastery's street. Elizabeth Dicock Schulder Stiefel Nonnen arose in 1712 as a personal initiative only two women. Pipsbeau Franz Rosina and Valberga bought by sharing the cost from Franciscan's two houses, and began to bring together around herself the women wishing to lead a pious life. Girlfriends earn money for the monastery, having arranged school of housekeeping. In the strange monastery of Cook's vows of obedience were given for only for one year then novices could come back to usual life. Only 60 years later after foundation of the monastery the official church recognized this, a public initiative. The cessation of the beginning of the 19th century found in the monastery of seven nuns. And allowed to live the rest of days there, but the monastery was closed. The history of this monastery is very closely connected with the most ancient buildings of Augsburg. In 1060 the Bishop of Augsburg and Brico near a present tower of Perlictum, on the place of an old chapel, in the trade settlement of merchants of the time-based little community of clergymen. The village of Lamadingen presented to her formed an economic basis of her life. Clergymen served in St. Peter's Church in a tower. In the same place also lived. Under the monastic charter. Perlicurm, the most ancient construction of Augsburg after the house. Only in 1260 citizens constructed the first town hall on the place of the building of Episcopal Court. In the monastery there were always very few clergymen, no more than ten, but it was the most aristocratic monastery of the city. By tradition all monks of Stiftshire and unto them Perlictum came from the best patrician surnames of Augsburg. They had a special submission, double, to the bishop and city council. The cessation of the beginning of the 19th century concerned also this unique monastery, it was closed. Near a basilica there was a monastery of Saints Ulrich and Afra earlier. It was founded by the reformist monks Benedictines who came here from the monastery on the Lake Tegern Sea. It happened in 1006 when Bruno, the brother of the Emperor Henry II was the Bishop of Augsburg. Till 1577 this monastery was the personal residence of the Augsburg bishops. In 1577 the Emperor Rudolf II granted to the monastery independence of the power of the Bishop of Augsburg, the right of direct submission of the sacred Roman Empire and direct belonging to priestly estate. After that within several centuries the monastery of Saints Ulrich and Afra took the important place among monasteries of East Swabia. An end of 800 year history of the monastery was put by lay cessation at the beginning of the 19th century. Attempts to revive the monastery weren't successful because of resistance of Bavaria and Augsburg which already divided among themselves the earth and property of the monastery. Monks were forced to refuse in 1835 these attempts and founded the new monastery of Benedictines St. Stephen, existing in until now. The monastery was turned into barracks for cavalry and military hospital. During World War II it was completely destroyed during bombings of the city by aircraft of allies. Monastery ruins completely sorted only in 1968.
on the plates of the monastery on the project of the architect Baron Alexander von Brank quite an expressive building, St. Ulrich's House, which serves to the Catholic community as the place of meetings and educational programs was built. In all Augsburg guides his main symbol the town hall on the Iron Mountain is considered. On this place the first town hall was constructed in 1385. Over time its scale ceased to correspond to the status grown rich on trade and crafts of Augsburg, and the city council decided to reconstruct it. But in the course of discussion of rebuilding plans there was a belief that it would be more correct to construct a new town hall. On August 24, 1615 the architect Elias Hall who became the author of her project solemnly put the first stone in the basis of a new town hall. Construction went very in high gear. In four years the town hall was already constructed and through four all internal works are finished. The town hall of Augsburg was then the only secular building in Europe height more than six floors. The strict elegance of its architecture conducts the origin from style of buildings of Florence. The new town hall cost to Augsburg more than card gold goldens, the sum huge for those times. Two ornaments on the town hall face. The imperial eagle and a cone of a stone pine symbolize the Roman past of Augsburg and its value in the sacred Roman Empire. The main room of the town hall is the gold hall. High to two and a half floors, beautiful large windows, rich gilding and painting. In the gold hall of already nearly 400 years there are main events in life of Augsburg. Receptions, rewardings, gala concerts. Near the gold hall there are princely rooms intended once for rest after the tiresome meetings. In 1944 the town hall was almost completely destroyed during bombings of Elias, but by 1954 is restored in the previous form, without distortions and additions. The gold hall was finally restored by 1985 when Augsburg celebrated 2000 from the date of foundation of the city. On the channel of the Lech River, in the typical burger house of the 16th, 17th centuries, the most known of writers of Augsburg, Eugenie Berthold Friedrich Brecht was born on February 10, 1898. When the city was going to no century since the birth of the famous fellow countryman, in 1985 on the building there was a memorial plate. And in 1998 the exposition devoted to Brecht opened here. Family House Brechtoff Elizabeth Haindel, the widow of the founder of paper mill George Haindel, built four identical buildings on Blakestrasse. She followed the example of founders of the House Fugarov, having created a social complex in the factory district of Augsburg. All apartments in these houses were identical. A lobby, three rooms, kitchen, the cellar and the small site of a garden under a window. The rent made about a quarter of usual in the city. These houses were intended for workers and employees of paper mill. Bertolt Brecht's father was at first an employee, and then one of managing directors of this factory. As the employee of factory and one of trustees of her social institutions, he lived in one of her social houses. The memorial plate reminds of it now. The family Brechtoff occupied the second floor in a penthouse. Here Bertolt Brecht wrote the first works. In 1943, in emigration in the USA, Brecht remembered this house in the poem Ein Frujarsabend in der Vorstadt.
second house of family Brechthoff. Near Alsenstadtbad, the family Brechthoff lived in this house two years. From September 1898 to September 1900. Here Berthold Brecht's brother Walzer was born. On the house there are a memorial plate and a relief of ancient Roman times so it is easy to find it. Children Brechthoff went to Stadtbad often. Nearly in every week. Their funth per term. This romantic small tower sideways from Jakobrita, the rest of the former city strengthenings. For young Brecht, funth per term was a symbol of poetry and legends. Castanova Avenue going to a tower Brecht's judges is considered a literary monument. I can't fart. It is possible to pass on Berthold Brecht Street to one of the most well-loved by the poet of the Augsburg sites. This romantic pier for boats at Obliter Wall. On the legend which developed among Brecht's admirers, here the young poet earned with river carrying to himself pocket money. Leopold Mozart 1719-1787 who was born in this house is known in Augsburg not in itself and as Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart's father. By it it is of particular interest to his name. The memorial plate on the building appeared in 1858. In 1937 in the building there was a museum, and in 1939 Hassan Braigi which then possessed this building, presented it to the city. Before destructions of February, 1944 in Augsburg there was a building belonging to the well-known dynasty of artists Holbein. There lived Hans Holbein Sr. 1465-1524 And both of his sons, Ambrosius, 1494-1519 And Hans Holbein Jr. 1496-1543 who go be enough to the whole Europe glorified by the portraits family. He became in 1537 the court artist of the English King Henry VIII. Hans Holbeinger. Pictures are not only in the European capitals, but also in Gallery of Ancient Masters in Augsburg and in the city cathedral. After war the house Golbienev was restored, but not in that look in what he was earlier. In 1996 the building was transferred to the Augsburg Association of Artists. Here regularly exhibitions of modern artists are organized. In this house there lived the famous artist and the draftsman Hans Bergmeer. His best works can be seen in Gallery of Ancient Masters and in Church of the Monastery Saint of Katharina in Schelzer Palais. The pictures Brookmeyer are appreciated around the world, their plots, composition and picturesque color enriched the art culture of the 16th century. This house at the end of 15, the beginning of the 16th century, was in possession of the well known surname of Velza. Now he maximizes part, but a memorial plate reminds of Bartholomew Velza. 1484 1561. The famous merchant and the banker from an old patrician family. Bartholomew Velza within 30 years was the only owner of trade with Venezuela, new colony of Spain, the country of gold mines and gemstones. He acquired this right together with the father, Anton Velza, from the King of Spain in exchange for guarantees of receipts in the Spanish treasury of the huge sums of money annually. 
At the beginning of the 16th century every third ship under the Spanish flag going from Seville belonged Valzerum. Only in 1556 the Spanish Council for Affairs indeterminated the contract, exclusively favorable for Valzaref. Bartolome Valza didn't stand apart also from affairs of the city. From 1548 to 1556 he was a member of the patrician government of Augsburg. In 1438, brothers Ulrich and Jacob Fuggery got a complex of houses on He. Na Philippine Welsestras. And meat. Na Anastras. The markets. In this house, there was the well known cold room of the trade empire of Fuggerov. When for the famous family these houses became too small, some more houses in the wine market were bought. In 1944, houses Fugarov were completely destroyed. After war, they were restored, but not such as earlier. From an initial complex, only two late Gothic portals on both sides of the house remained. Here it is possible to see lilies of a family crest Fugarov and the Fugarovsky lions dressed in an armor. There is on the house also a memorial plate telling about his history. Since Protestantism of A. Basil of Saints Afra and Ulrich caused together with the neighbor Evangelic Church of Saint Ulrich. In the city there are some more places where Evangelic and Catholic churches stand nearby. These are churches of the Holy Spirit near the house in St. Johann and St. Thomas's church on Ulmerstrasse. The hill on which the basilica is located was consecrated with Christian churches during an era of the early Middle Ages. Here since the 5th century there were pilgrims. To go to St. Afra. In 973 relics of the Bishop Ulrich, the savior of the city from Hungarian pagans were added to St. Afra's relics. The late Roman church in the 7th century was replaced by an era Basilica Merovingov, in century on the place of Merovingsky church the Basilica of Times of Carlovingians appeared. At the beginning of the 11th century and this basilica disappeared. I gave way to church in style of early Romance art. But the hill was out of city strengthenings and therefore churches and buildings surrounding them often perished from invasions of the enemy and the fires. Everything changed when in 1012 near church the Benedictine monastery of Saints Ulrich and Afra appeared. Emergence of the monastery made this area more brisk and it increased its safety. The church became monastic. Then it somewhere was one third shorter than today, and her south side is wider than northern. Modern church, the fifth or sixth on this hill. It conducts the family tree since 1474. Brick construction was finished in rough in 1500 by the architect Engelbert. He, by the way, built also the well-known cathedral in Ulm. In rough, because construction of cathedral continued still very long. These are those reasons resulted in stagnation of construction works from time to time, and then good luck or divine carrying out restored them to life again. When 1300 year anniversary of Saint Afra began to come, builders hurried. The church was handed over, at last, to the customer in 1604. The basilica belonged to the monastery, Imperial Abbey of an award of Saint Benedict. In 1802 lay cessation processes, that is elimination of church possession began. The church was lowered in a rank, turned just into parish, and it was necessary to wait for nearly one and a half centuries before the basilica returned itself a church rank. 
In 1937 the Church of Saints Afra and Ulrich became a papal basilica, having turned into direct submission to Vatican. Weapon House or Arsenal Originally City Arsenal was constructed along with the Foundry Yard in 1501 Elias Hall, 1602, took part in creation of the modern building. The bronze cast group on east facade of the weapon house, as well as the general plan of this facade, doesn't belong to Elias Hall's authorship. Saint Michael the Archangel represented here plunging the Satan was perceived by citizens as the Counter-Reformation Celebration Allegory. The Archangel is familiar to all Augsburgsets on the September holidays to Ramishal at Town Hall Square. The architectural concept of East Facade was executed by Joseph Hens and figures the sculptor Hans Rechtel and the founder Wolfgang Nedkart. Hens arrived to Augsburg from Basel and Fugger of executed orders of family. The sculptor Hans Reckel from Chenneau. The founder Wolfgang Nedkart is known that he cast the well-known Hercules Brennan and Merker Brennan of the sculptor Adrian D. Vris in bronze. Till 1895 the building performed function of an arsenal then it was turned into fire depot. However not only fire accessories, but also weapon for 1300 soldiers and the gun continued to be stored here. After the loss of the independence by Augsburg the weapon house in 1809 carried over the Bavarian Kingdom and continued to be used for storage of weapons and ammunition. In 1893 Augsburg redeemed the building from the government of Bavaria, having paid gold brands. The city was limited to storage only of fire equipment here now. The weapon house burned down in February, 1944, during bombings of Augsburg by aircraft of Allies. The weapon house restored after war in the 1960th was sold by city council to the trade concern Horton building the shops on Maritzplatz. Creation of three famous masters could be reconstructed or changed, having lost historical lines. 1965 This initiative was sharply negatively apprehended by citizens. The Bavarian Protection Department of Historical Monuments forbade concern any distortions and demanded transfer of the weapon house again to the property of Augsburg. Fire tackles returned on their place in the downtown. In 1975 the fire management received new, modern buildings. In 1978, 1980 restoration was made and in the building the school, movie theater and restaurant were placed. Now there take place various exhibitions. In December, 1980 buildings on Begegnings and from der Stadt Augsburg, Biergarten and the Exhibition Center opened here. The Weapon House and the Augsburg Volksschule uses for the occupations. The main cathedral of Augsburg is called Morendum. He is very well known in Europe. In all encyclopedias on art of Europe Morendum in Augsburg, cathedral in which the earliest color stained glass windows in the world remained. Earlier than in Augsburg color stained glass windows appeared in France, but there they didn't remain in original state so the city on Lec was the first in the list. On the Augsburg stained glass windows created in the second half of the 11th century Bible prophets are represented. The way allowing to create pictures from colored glass is dated the middle of the 10th century. Only then learned to do thin sheet glass of the big sizes. Pieces of colored glass connected a lead cover. 
before there were not stained glass windows, but column mosaics from glass because it wasn't possible to make pieces of those sizes at which there are pictures on glass. Stained glass windows in Augsburg are executed in the early, transitional equipment of a transparent mosaic. In 1321 monks from Carmelite order built the monastery and church in the present downtown. At first the church was small, but in about 100 years its area almost doubled. In 1420 in church gold should capel with wall painting appeared well known now. In century the church was reconstructed again. In 1510 there was the second chapel, Heilegrab Kapel, and in 1518, Fugger Kapel. In the same 16th century, St. Anne's Church got the whole collection of fine painting. Among pictures, and now decorating church, famous Lacus Cranach Sr. Cloths. In St. Anne's Church there is a chapel of the most known Augsburgsets for all history of the city, surnames Fugarov, created in style of the Renaissance. It was the first Renaissance construction in Germany. In 1520 exactly here, in the Monastery of Carmelites, Luther called by the order of the Pope for a theological discussion with the Father's representative Cardinal Gate and stopped. Here, in case Luther refuses to confess any delusions, Gaetan intended to arrest him and to send for a court to Rome. Luther went to Augsburg from Wittenberg on foot, by old tradition of the wandering monks. He could be killed on the road, but Luther believed that his terrestrial destiny is not in power of the Pope. Luther in the Carmelite Monastery of St. Anne from October 7 to October 20, the 1520th year spent the night. I met the Cardinal Getten and Luther in the Fujera Palace. Though Luther had a charter of immunity from the Emperor, the danger of arrest became obvious. At night, secretly, accompanied by only one conductor allocated to it with Magistrate of Augsburg, Luther leaves the city. Now in St. Anne's Church there is a small museum of Martin Luther, and his portrait hangs. St. Anne's Church became at the time of the Reformation the first evangelic church in the city. In 1551 at the monastery in St. Anne's Church, the school which became subsequently St. Anne's Gymnasium was founded. At the beginning of the 17th century, Elias Hall built the new building for school and library. He constructed also a tower of church. In the 18th century, all three naves of church were issued in Baroque style. Approach of 2000 year anniversary of Augsburg and the anniversary celebrated in 1985 drew attention of numerous tourists to the city. In a tourist brand of the city St. Anne's Church occupied then one of the leading positions. Since then the growth of attendance of church by tourists continuing still began. There was a question of reconstruction of the territory of church. There was a new yard and a half in style to the Italian architecture of Renaissance. The area repeats the Italian piazzas of the 15th, 16th centuries. There were also underground parking, cafe, a modern complex of exhibitions and meetings, Augustanisal. All tourist routes across Augsburg steadily include visit of Church of Saint Anna. The former princely episcopal residence is a complex of buildings in an old part of Augsburg, near the house. Formerly years of construction of the residence. 1740-1752, but the residence includes and the reconstructed buildings of the 16-17 centuries. 
The main building of the former princely episcopal residence originally arose from three houses of times of the Middle Ages standing closely to each other. The present tower is more senior than the main building of the palace too. It is the Falski Tower Chapel raised in 1507-1508. In 1680 at the Bishop Johann Christoph von Freiburg separate buildings were connected in a single whole. The main wing of two days residence is constructed in 1743 by the architect Johann Ettel, and the northern wing in 1752 Franz Kleinschens in style of late Baroque. And this style mixed up in organic unity of line of Baroque and Rococo, having yielded excellent result. Kleinschens was one of the most famous church architects of Bavaria and Austria in due time. He not only constructed nine churches in the different cities, but also participated in construction even more than 70 church constructions. The balcony uplifted by columns on height of a solemn entrance in magnificent east portal arose not only as an ingenious plan of the architect. He is later than the main buildings of the residence. Years of his construction minus 1784-1789 and he became the father Pius VI embodied in a stone by reminiscence of visit of the residence in 1782. The wing attached in the southwest to a Falski chapel is later. It is constructed in 1902 as well as the building attached to it for guards barracks. The Falski Chapel embodies very ancient type of chapels conducting the beginning since the Byzantine Christianity. Also history of internal furniture of the residence isn't less interesting. Frescoes on the parties of a solemn front staircase are created by the director of the State City Academy of Arts Johann Berg Müller in 1752. On them among other allegories like in Vertic, Danube are represented. Between cartouches of the coats of arms and the image of the customer of paintings there are main Platonovsky virtues. Mind, justice, bravery and mercy. Over all them divine providence reigns. Bergmüller painted with Marienkapelle in the Augsburg house and many churches in other Episcopal city, Eichstadt. Decorated with figures of angels booty, the lobby conducts to the whole of Rococo reconstructed in this style by the Bishop Joseph Hess Darmstadt. Now there take place musical concerts, and two Episcopal inventions of Hess Darmstadt it was the hall of the Augsburg Cathedral capital in which the Augsburg recognition of the rights of Lutherans, Confessio Augustana was announced on June 25, 1530. In honor of this event glorified to the whole Europe on the residence there is a memorial plate. On walls of the Hall of Rococo eight the pictures painted by oil in which among other characters imperial couple is represented. Franz I and Maria II Teresa. To the east of the residence the former lordly yard is located. Once it was the area for farm buildings, then this yard was partially used as the cemetery for employees of the residence, then the cemetery disappeared, and on his place there was in the 19th century an educational parade ground for military, and in 1878 the parade ground turned into the public square. Since 1817 the residence after the Bavarian lay cessation of church property was occupied by the government of Swabia. Hofgarten, a part of the residence of the Archbishop built in the 18th century. The garden was planned by Caspar Bignotto in 1744. In 1817 when in Bavaria everywhere the property of church passed to the state, from church also Hofgarten became state. Since 1963 the garden rents the city of Augsburg. A lease term minus 55 euros in a year of the rent and, 
euros in a year of overhead costs on the maintenance of a garden. For the two first years of rent a solemn and graceful court air was returned to a garden. From a usual rural orchard what became a court garden after World War II, there was Hofgarten again. On the place of fruit trees, trees from Japan of tulip type appeared. In 1965 the garden was opened for free visit. From 2002 to 2005 Hofgarten for the third time for his history updated restoration works. The previous two times were in the 19th century. Now in a court garden fans of arts can see at the same time characteristic features of park planning and baroque and rococo. Flowers, bushes of a hibiscus and wisteria, green hedges and pyramids, decorative fishes in a pond, benches for rest and a sculpture restored a situation of the 18th and 19th centuries. Five figures from sandstone created in 1744 by the sculptor Johann Schindel surprise visitors of a garden with the singularity. Many for want of habitate them for wizards, gnomes a satirical grotesque. The expression of Baroque is aggravated to a limit by the image of court dwarfs here. Sculptures of this kind in the 18th century were a very popular subject and met in many cities of Europe. Fellows of these sculptures stand, for example, in a garden Mirabel Plum's Palace in Salzburg. The Augsburg sculptures till 1963 were in the Wittelsbachov Park along a present route of the first tram. Also the history in a corner of Hofgarten of the bookcase open for all is interesting. It is the former art project of 2001 of the American innovators Michael Klegger and Martin Gutman. The sense of the project consisted in that from a case not only took in a book garden for reading, but also could bring and put own books in a case. The case reminded an art show window, towered on three meters and had beautiful collar in style of a Mackin. The project was temporary, but citizens so liked this idea that when Americans took away the case, residents of Augsburg at once to the place of the American case put the The difficult hydraulic engineering construction on Lech is among historical monuments of Augsburg. Precisely it is difficult to translate the German name. The approximate translation sounds as a water dam on the high falling water. The bridge through Lech, at once behind a dam, has sculptures, the look and size kind of signaling the traveler that he got to a cultural zone. On a small plate almost at once behind sculptures the small chapel in the form of a tent rises. Near a chapel, hidden by trees, there is a monument to the winner of the French Duke Carl. If to walk on a footpath further, there is a building noted in all guides as Wasserwerk A.M. Hockeblas. Constructed in style of late classicism, with two beautiful towers, it is painted in ancient style inside and on a terrace. In the building the cars operating wasserwork mechanisms in the huge hall in 37 meters of length and the 17th width were placed. Actually, also all the rest is called as the general name Wasserwerk A.M. Hockeblas. Both a dam and her mechanisms and an anchor at a dam and sculptures. When this dam was only constructed, it was a technical miracle. Enthusiastic contemporaries called it the Temple of the Equipment. This temple cost to Augsburg card Rixmark. The industrial architecture of the end of 19 and the beginning of the last century, at all new decisions and materials, kept indissoluble communication with an aesthetics of the previous architectural styles. 
From there are sculptures, the symbolizing lichen vertic, a huge anchor, a proud lion on a pedestal. The lion appeared here in 1914. In honor of a visit on a dam of the King of Bavaria Ludwig III with the spouse. Also work a M. Hockeblast decorated as it was accepted to decorate only palace parks earlier. Flotinus wasn't by then a novelty anymore. Official date of opening of a dam is on October 1, 1879. The dam gave pump strength of the falling water, and pumps pump from underground sources water in the system of city pipelines. Creators of a dam provided also special exits for fish. The chapel near a dam burned in 1979. It was restored by means of the city in 1994, however, not completely. Only a dome. In 1994, Wasserwerk AM Blast stopped being the management building. He arranged the Technical Museum of Water Affairs and Information Center. The need in separate management of Wasserwerk AM Hockeblast disappeared gradually, in process of transition on the electrician instead of mechanics. Since 1942. New methods reduced first of all need in personnel until it remained so a little that it became finally unprofitable to keep Department of Wasserwerk here. In 1973 the dam ceased to supply the city with water, but didn't cease to work. She continues to give approximately for 5000 residents the electric power. As for water supply, now 2400 inhabitants of neighboring houses use her services. The speaking name at home weavers. The live evidence of former glory of Augsburg is one of the largest weaver's centers of Europe. This building in style of late Gothic was built anew more than once, and also anew there were his well-known paintings. The allegorical subjects devoted to the history of the city are entered in lists of the Bavarian sites. In 1389 the guild of the Augsburg weavers for 700 florins bought this house to organize in it the meetings. Inside weavers decorated the hall with a painted wooden ceiling, hall walls, painting. Paintings arose not at once, and in 1437 so they conduct the family tree with this date. But in 1538 paintings made anew, in new style. The shop of weavers had big money. Their union included representatives of nearly 20 hundred weavers' workshops. At the end of the 16th century the building passed to the city, and already city masters in 1607 for the third time changed paintings of this building. The 20th century brought to the house of weavers many troubles. They began long before destructions of World War II. In 1913, despite protests of citizens, the House of Weavers took down. The reason was simple. Disturbs new, direct and wide streets of the downtown. Frescoes, however, carefully copied. Copies were useful in 1936 when the building, at the request of citizens, was built up anew. The second time the House of Weavers died in 1944 during destructive bombings of the city. For the second time it was built up in 1958. Then for several years the House of Weavers was painted anew again on the remained copies. For the third time the House of Weavers nearly died completely on June 30, 2004 when the strong fire broke up. Money for restoration came from insurance company in which the House of Weavers was insured. 
but this sum wasn't enough for everything, and patriots of the city offered for a work of painters of more euros. Old frescoes kept, but added also new. Artists represented on building facades the main events from the history of Augsburg, having skillfully connected them by means of allegories with events of world history. In Augsburg, five former surf gate remained. Bird's Gate, Red Gate, Gate of Fishermen, St. Yakov's Gate, Bridge Gate through Vertic. They are supported by the city in a full order and are considered as some of the main attractions of the city. The Remain Gate have different architecture. All of them are unlike at each other. The Oberberger Mermita has eight assistance reviewers. Two of them, two burgomasters, the second and third. The second burgomaster is responsible for financial control of expenses of the city budget, staff recruitment and housing. The sphere of responsibility of the third burgomaster, culture, youth and sport. Other assistants, just reviewers. The first reviewer is responsible for environmental protection and power policy. The second reviewer is responsible for purity of the city and state of nature. The third reviewer is responsible for integration, for family policy, for disabled people and pensioners. The fourth reviewer is responsible for education. The fifth reviewer is responsible for construction, transport, water supply, protection of historical monuments and for development of the city in general. The sixth reviewer bears responsibility for protection of an order in the city, the Ministry of Emergency Situations, Trade, Healthcare, all exhibitions and holidays. Besides reviewers there are still commissions. In each of them on 12 people. In total the commissions in the government of Augsburg 14. Spheres of their responsibility much already, than at reviewers. Such approach provides focus in study and decision making. Directions of responsibility of the commissions. Finance, culture, sport, environment protection, education, personnel, justice, social policy, economy, funds, real estate and general questions. The main work on adoption of professionally prepared decisions happens in the commissions, and burgomasters and reviewers play a role of coordinators of process. Education At 40 national schools of Augsburg 15000 younger school students study. After their termination they go, generally to gymnasiums and real schools, at the same time in gymnasiums much more children than at real schools study. In 10 gymnasiums of Augsburg minus 9500 pupils and at 7 real schools minus 3500. At a step of secondary education in the city 4 to Zenton, 1500 pupils, Vildorfsky school minus 400 pupils, educational institutions of other types minus 650 pupils are also presented. In Augsburg 2100 teachers and pupils at schools of all types and levels. Professional secondary education is presented in Augsburg by different types of schools. Most of all pupils are employed in seven vocational schools. Minus one two zero zero zero. At twenty four specialized vocational schools. Minus eighteen hundred pupils on only seventy five people on average in every one at three higher vocational schools to 1800 pupils but already on average in 600 people in every one 
Ten hundred more pupils are employed in six special vocational schools. 350 people study in professional academy. And 750, a vocational school for disabled people. More than 18000 people get higher education in Augsburg. Generally they study at the University of Augsburg minus 14000 students. At the University of Augsburg it is possible to choose as future profession sociology and philosophy, philology and history, theology and mathematics. At the higher vocational school minus 40 hundred students. It differs from the university in narrower range of training presented by the equipment, economy and management. 550 people study at the higher music school of Augsburg, Nuremberg. 52000 adults attend national schools of continuation of education, where various short-term courses are presented. It is almost fit part of the population of the city. In private medical city institutions of Augsburg, 935 doctors work. Among them, stomatologists have absolute majority. 228 experts with a big separation on the second place therapists them in Augsburg 152 on the third place specialists in internal diseases minus 127 gynecologists 62 and surgeons 54 Close the five of the most popular medical professions. Go further. Pediatricians. 46. Orthopedists. 38. Neurology. 28. Oculists. 27. And anesthesiologists. 21. It is most less than psychiatrists in Augsburg. There of everything 15 on inhabitants. In private offices not all doctors of Augsburg work. Clinics work still about the same, including psychiatrists, but there are no exact data on clinics. In Augsburg also work 241 druggists. In Augsburg, 30 nursing homes in which there are 3,900 places. However, from these 3,900 places, about 700 places for incomplete stay. But the system of rendering medical care to elderly people by some nursing homes isn't limited. There are 45 more medical institutions rendering the outpatient help. For disabled people there is also a special administrative body. German of Behindertenbenberit. At the city government. In seven special houses for disabled people 270 permanent residences are created. Media. Among the German editions of the main two. Eibsberger Allgemeinen Staatszeitung. The first of them exists since 1807, the second is founded in 1979. Eibsberger Allgemein, the paid newspaper, Staatszeitung, free. At Eibsberger Allgemein, daily circulation. With regional releases. This card copies, Staatszeitung leaves once a week as a part of 15 regional releases with a general circulation of card copies. Meddingbrook Mayor and Sound Publishing Stadtzeitung decided to master one more direction not so long ago, and now on Sundays at stops of transport there is a tabloid Augsburger Sant Express. Despite a glossy cover, volume and solid registration, carry two classical tabloids also Augsburg Journal. 
The modest but cultural monthly journal Neuschien Augsburg looks the complete antithesis of Augsburg Journal. His 25000 readers find culture news there. There is still the whole family of regional intracity editions. They are not less than 10. For example, the southern districts of Augsburg issue the Augsburger Sudanziger magazine and Fursi, classical burgers vestia of local scale. Russian language press. In Augsburg there was a regional issue of Munich Plus newspaper under the name Augsburg Plus with a circulation of 10000 copies for Augsburg and Ingolstadt and there is still Evening Augsburg, with a circulation of 1500 copies. Also there are two magazines. Poster Augsburg and Svetlana in Germany. The picture of radio companies is also various. And there are leaders. Main among them, Hitradio Art. His audience is extensive. From seniors to 40 year old. At the heart of success of this radio station, close cooperation with Augsburger Allgemein. Together with this Hitradio Art newspaper hosts detailed reports on all main events of sports, musical and public life of the city. Specializing in reports, Hitradio Art left free a music niche, and she was occupied by Radio Fantasy Radio Station. Having defined for itself as the main audience of aged people about 40 years, Radio Fantasy focused on style of their life. Support, music, travel. These are two leaders of the Augsburg Radio. Other radio stations divided among themselves separate segments. Rock Anten, the successor of Radio Co. Affiliated radio station and Ten Bairn. Apparently from the name specialization of Rock Anten, rock music. Other radio station, Smart Radio, specializes in jazz music and is without moderator, just selecting music for broadcasting. Radio Augsburg and Frozen Radio are among modest small radio stations with collective from several people too. It is interesting that till 1998 when in Augsburg still there were American troops, there was also an English language local radio station. American Forces Network Television In Augsburg there is the cable TV channel for daily programs Augsburg TV A TV But the city shares them with Bloomberg Television and Ertel Shop On this channel at Augsburg only 30 minutes of television time from 18 o'clock till 18.30 in a regional window of Ertel. However, with Astra 1F, in Golstedt, and TV Algona Crichton, Kempen, Augsburg has one more television. Local News, Local Cat, According to an early Christian hagiographical source of St. Aphra's Act, Aphra occurred from Cyprus. In Augsburg she was an attendant in the Temple of Venus. At government of the Emperor Diocletian in Augsburg there arrived from Spain the Bishop Narcissus who converted Aphra and her mother to Christianity. During persecutions on Christians the Bishop Narcissus disappeared in Aphra's house. His location was disclosed, and he was subjected to the death penalty through burning. A friend her mother ceased to visit traditional pagan religious services that caused suspicion. Soon Afra was arrested and subjected to interrogations and tortures. 
on interrogations Afra declared the devotion to Christianity for what she was sentenced to death and burned on August 7, 304 years. Next day Afra's body was found by servants intact. Mother and servants buried a body in the country. Afra's burial didn't remain unnoticed. Servants were seized on a denunciation and after refusal to participate in pagan rites accepted martyrdom too. By order of the judge they were burned in the same crypt where they buried Afra. Zimper comes from very noble family. There is no wonder, because the bishop's dignity couldn't be also given in those days to the commoner on the birth. The highest church positions were included into the list of the major for the class state. The Bishop Zimpert, the native nephew of the Emperor Charles the Great and the son of the Duke of Lorraine. The year of birth of Zimpert is precisely unknown. 750 is taken for a conditional reference point by tradition. Zimpert was born near Augsburg. Names of his parents. Ambert and Symphoniara, as well as his own name, are unusual for our time because they belong to two left language elements. Old German and Ancient Greek. The childhood and youth of future bishop precisely aren't described anywhere. Zimpert studied at monastic school, but in what it is precisely unknown. Closer to reality the name of Abi Mabak in Elsass where probably Zimpert accepted monastic tinsured. In 778 Zimpert became the Bishop of Augsburg where about 30 years I operated the local diocese. As well as Charles the Great, he constantly was concerned about expansion of the diocese, attaching to it everything new and new church districts, didn't create something like the general for the Bavarian Schwab of the church empire yet. Saint Simper did a lot of things for restoration damaged and constructions of new temples. He founded the well-known monastery Benedict's Iron in Bavaria. The national rumor turned the bishop Zimpert into the character of numerous legends. Saint Zimpert is esteemed as the savior of the disappeared or stolen small children. He is often represented with a staff, a near him, the wolf keeping in the child's mouth. Once, as the legend speaks, the wolf who dragged off the child thanks to Saint Zimpert's prayers returned the boy to his safe parents. In this legend relating to 1230, the prior Adilba tells about how the kid who was left without supervision departed far from the house, and the wolf dragged off him to the forest. Mother of the gone child very much esteemed Saint Zimpert. She, sobbing, I began to pray to the saint, asking him to intercede and get out of the child's trouble. After a while unexpectedly there was a wolf bringing two mouths of the kid, whole and safe. Grateful mother took the child on hands and incurred him to Augsburg where told it to inhabitants as she with a grief was helped on her prayers by Saint Zimpert. She also ordered from the Augsburg artist's masters a small wax bass relief on which the wolf keeping her child in a mouth was represented. This bass relief long time was near a tomb of Saint Zimpert who since the 15th century began to be represented thanks to a legend with a wolf. During sanitation of the Augsburg House St. Zimpert's tomb in September, 1977 was opened. In a copper reliquary found his relics and the text of life of the saint dated 1492. Zimpert was canonized in 1468 by the Pope Nicolay V. St. Zimpert's memory is noted by tradition on October 13. Ulrich, it is traditional, 
as well as many priests who reached office heights, the native of notable family. He was born in Augsburg in 890. In 10 years he was sent for training to monastic school of street. Colin to Switzerland. There he stayed up to 18 years, and after the end of training returned to the hometown. The Bishop of Alpara became his spiritual mentor in Augsburg. The notable origin and Adalpara's protection had to give a lot of things to Ulrich. He was sent to Rome where he received the place at the Father Sergia. Didn't pass also a year of stay in Rome as Ulrich was told a sad message about the death of the Bishop Adalpara. Shaken by the incident, Ulrich urgently comes back to Augsburg. He doesn't want to come back to Rome and lives in the parental estate. Apparently, this life didn't prevent Ulrich to continue a divine service as in 923 he was hailed the bishop. He was then only 33 years old. The remain sources, perhaps a little legendary, speak about the bishop Ulrich as about the pastor strict but fair and kind. Ulrich opened church school in Augsburg, constructed three churches, restored initial orders and services and a way of life of clergy. The Emperor Atana invited him to take part in government. In 907 the aggressive Hungarian tribes which came to Europe from the Sisural steppes took East Brand of the Empire of Charles the Great. From there they made devastating attacks to Swabia, Bavaria and Lorraine. Hungarians were pagans, and their domination threatened not only the state, but also church. In 955 Hungarians intruded in Swabia and approached Augsburg. They thought that the treasury of Bavaria therefore we intended to take Augsburg by all means is stored in the city. The Bishop Ulrich called citizens for defense. In the city there were few soldiers, but support of citizens stopped Hungarians under walls of Augsburg. Legends remain that Ulrich participated also in night sorties of soldiers from the city, certainly without weapon. Having learned about approach of army of the Emperor Otten, Hungarians departed from the city, being afraid of blow from two parties. The main event took place on August 10, 955, in Day of Remembrance of St. Lavrenti, in Leches Valley. In day before battle soldiers fasted and prayed. They forgave each other offenses and sins and swore to stand up to the end fight. The Bishop Ulrich was an inspirer of these prayers. Hungarians was much more than Otten's soldiers, but the firmness of spirit, training and discipline won. To the bishop in a dream before fight Saint Afra was and out predicted a victory over the enemy. The house in Augsburg is faced by a monument to the bishop Ulrich inspiring soldiers on fight. St. Ulrich is often represented with a staff of the bishop and fish in a hand. These images are connected with a legend of transformation of a piece of meat into fish. Versions of a legend a little. On one of them, the bishop still wishes that to discredit him, palmed off on him on Friday meat, but meat wonderfully turned into fish. The legend also narrates that, having felt approach of death, St. Ulrich ashes drew a cross on the earth, sprinkled him with holy water, then laid down on this place and with singing of a litany departed to the Lord. It happened in 973. In several years the close friend of Ulrich, a certain Sturkhard, wrote his life. The foundation of legends of the Bishop Ulrich was laid already then. Rumors about any miracles which are made on a tomb of the bishop about the miracles which are made as a result of his hidden protection went. 
legends and miracles gain such distribution that in 993, in only 20 years after Ulrich's death, he was canonized by the Pope Pio in 15. It was the first official act of popes of canonization. On July 4 in Augsburg note how day of remembrance of Saint Ulrich. Relics of the bishop are stored not in the house, and in church of Saints Ulrich and Afra. They were found and reburied after restoration of church in the fire of 1183. The coat belonging to St. Ulrich, the cross worn on the neck brought by him from Rome in 954 and a silver glass are stored in the Museum of Idiots as of Augsburg. The Russian Orthodox Church of an icon of the Mother of God, all grieving reduced, in Augsburg is in the region of Fursi. Here regular church services are made and discussions are led. As of 2011 arrival totals over 120 parishioners. The Russian Orthodox Church in Augsburg gives the classes under the God's Law for Children of Orthodox Religion recognized by the Ministry of Culture of Bavaria which replace lessons of religion and ethics at schools. The history of Russian Orthodox Church in Augsburg begins in the 30s the 20th century. In April, for Easter, to the Russian emigrants living in Augsburg and the neighborhood of the city from Berlin there came the priest. The first such arrival was in 1934. Since 1936 visits of Augsburg by the priest from Berlin became regular. The chapel in St. Anne's Church was provided for church services in 1936. Unfortunately, it wasn't possible to agree somewhere on a constant basis, and every year it was necessary to look for the room anew. Nevertheless, since 1937 church services began to be made in Augsburg already annually and then monthly. Gradually also arrival, constant community with the registered dicks began to develop. The sea beginning of war the number of her dicks reached 200 parishioners. Generally it were emigrants with a long-standing, with Nansenovsky passports. Church services began to take place in a chapel of Church of St. Anne again. When war ended, the number of parishioners of the Augsburg arrival practically didn't change, but their structure sharply changed. Now it were parishioners of the most different nationalities. Russians, Ukrainians, Poles, Estonians, Latvians. It was a direct consequence of war. Most of parishioners lived in the refugee camp in Hunstetten. In 1945 in Augsburg the constant priest appeared. It was succeeded to rent apartment in which both the priest and library of arrival and parish office and house church accommodated. Services in house church were made only in the winter because in the summer constant services went to street churches. Alice till 1954, Wind Street. Alice was closed on repair. Two years parishioners could use after the hospitality of street church. Max and then 14 years since 1954 on 1968. Services passed in the room of the former synagogue on Ulmerstrasse. In 1968 Orthodox Parish got again permission to hold the church services to street churches. Alice, by then already repaired. However, there it was impossible to leave sacred vessels, vestments and icons. All this should be carried away after service with itself. Meanwhile after war as a result of inflow of refugees the number of the Augsburg Parish of Orthodox Church grew twice, to 400 decks of community, then up to 500. Taking into account the unregistered decks the church was constantly visited by about 1000 people.
the Count Musen Pushkin became the head of Arrival in 1945. At Arrival the library was formed. Both church books and church music, there was own small printing house in which newsletters and books were issued. In 1947 Augsburg became the center of the Swabian Orthodox Church district consisting of seven arrivals. But then Dicks of Arrival began to part to other places, and in 1952 the number of the Augsburg Arrival fell up to 150 Dicks. Many Orthodox Christians lived in Bobingina close to Augsburg. The small Augsburg community in 1950-1960 almost only consisted of patients, poor people and old men, and the content of arrival laid down on shoulders of the city authorities and charitable organizations. Has often changed. Most longer on this post, it is more than 20 years am. Madorni who in 1994 was replaced by Larissa Schutt stayed. From the beginning of broad Russian language emigration to Germany situation changed. The number of dicks of the Augsburg Orthodox parish grew again. In Augsburg there is the Jewish community numbering 1800 parishioners. As of 2010. In a middle part of the well-known Hospital of the Holy Spirit since 1948 there is not less well-known theater of puppets. German of Augsburger Papenkist. Based by Rosa and Walter Quemichin. This theater uses broad popularity not only in Germany, but also in other countries. In many of them the theater visited tours, it is known also thanks to television. About 600 doll characters participate in performances of theater. All dolls, despite their huge number, are created as an individual image with the character and a look. In creation of such ensemble forces and talent of many people are put. Doll affairs of masters, screenwriters, artists, psychologists. In 2001 at Theater the Museum, Dykist, which was already in time to win great popularity among guests of theater, is created. In the museum, there is not only a constant exhibition. Here, periodically, also thematic expositions are arranged. Children's Theater Abraxas. This theater opened quite recently, in 1995, but already managed to win wide popularity. The Children's Theater Abraxas. German of Kulturhaus Abraxas. Was created not just as theater and as a cultural complex. In this complex, there is both a theater and showroom, and creative workshops and music school. In the repertoire of theater performances for children and adults and representation of experimental forms. The building is in the territory of the former American barracks. His internal planning has in many respects innovative character. The Hotel Tower which became at the same time concert hall and a symbol of the city was constructed in 1964-1972 on the project of the Stuttgart architect Max Spadel in the Wittelsbacher Park. He is among the highest in Europe minus 118 meters. The big sizes of the concert hall don't allow him to bring together very often public, but many prestigious statements take place exactly here. Large-scale musicals and symphony concerts of the Augsburg Bolshoi Theater, concerts of the European stars during their tours and choral ensembles, all this this congress hailed by the most known and popular scene of the city. In 1880 famous Dr. Hessing decided to expand a complex of the orthopedic clinic, by means of the architect Jean Keller. The building with a winter garden in popular then style of the new renaissance became the center of the park. 
this building with the hole on 500 places became not only one of the most beautiful in Augsburg, but also miracle of engineering art. Here advanced technologies of construction were applied, central heating, and inside, to surprise of citizens is carried out, electric lamps shown. The Park Theatre was registered as summer and gave representations only in warm season, performing function of the Cultural Center for Vacationers and Patients of Clinic. The palace from light and glass, as it was called in the city, extended over time. In 1925 there was a dance hall here, and in 1942 movie theater. In 1972 the fire destroyed the well-known building, but it was restored, and not only restored, but also gave the status of an architectural monument. Then eight years, from 1988 to 1996, Kirkhouse's reconstruction lasted, and on February 1, 1996, ten years ago, he opened already as Park Theatre Augsburg. Generally by already developed tradition, there are musicals and comedies, operettas and dancing parties here. Augsburg, the homeland of several famous bands. One of them, the Seer. Founded in 1990, the group chose for itself the style which mixed elements of fate and ethope. But as early as years for ten to the sea of the group with the provocative name Impotence flashed on the musical horizon of Germany. Pernutten and I met song so offended tastes of public that the Bavarian radio entered this song in the list forbidden for execution. Appearance of new, prospective bands in Augsburg isn't surprising. From 68 years of the last century Augsburg is known among musicians as the platform for ascension upward, on the level of Bavaria or even Germany. It is the conscious policy of management of culture of the city willingly giving opportunities for a performance to little known collectives. For example, not so local the Rough Roads, the Shotguns, Nova International and Anaya were such stars, which lit up in Augsburg. From the Augsburg groups I reached the dear John Letta level of Bavaria, however, at the expense of the active offer of the music on the internet, but not on scenic platforms. However, her late fate makes success and on platforms now. The basis of musical life of Augsburg is made by choral singing. In Augsburg about 70 choruses, the church choir, most famous in Augsburg, Domsinknaben, which is under patronage of the main Augsburg Cathedral. This chorus has long traditions. It is mentioned in sources since 1439. The chorus not only accompanies church services in street. Mary's Cathedral, but also performs with concerts. And in Germany and abroad. Also discs with record of these concerts are issued. The second in popularity choir of Augsburg belongs to Theatre of Augsburg. The chorus accompanies opera and musical representations of theatre and gives own concerts. During the holidays devoted to year of Mozart in 2006, one more chorus from Augsburg, Mozartker Augsburg gained the European popularity. Founded in 1976, Mozartker Augsburg took oratorios in a basis of the repertoire. This repertoire allows Chorus of Mozart now to perform with the most famous performers and orchestras of Europe. From other Augsburg choral collectives it is possible to note Chorus Albert Greiner Singand Music Schule and Chorus Gymnasiums by Street. Stefan these two choruses are known also outside Augsburg. The most famous orchestra of Augsburg, Bayerische Kammerphilharmonie, founded in 1990. 
at the heart of the repertoire of orchestra interpretation of classical and modern music. Twice Bayerische Kammerphilharmonie from Augsburg received the highest European awards. For the Priester European Wirtschaft and Kultur Priester European Region. There is the orchestra and the theater of Augsburg has Philharmonische Orchester der Stadt Augsburg. Seventy musicians are its part. Salon and Liebuchester belonging to Bukowina Institute is interesting that it is made of professionals and talented fans. Such a allows 13 musicians to play a peculiar experimental music and to go with tours on the different cities of Europe. Researchers counted in 30 towns and manors around Augsburg not less than 600 representatives of the sort Mozart of. Here the short chronology Mozart of presented in the book by Martin Kluger, Augsburg Mozart 1331, in the blotter of the monastery Oberschnell, the surname Mozart is for the first time recorded. 1480, in Augsburg in trade books the surname Mozart is for the first time recorded. 1486, the first mention of the house belonging Mozartum. In the village of Heimburg near Fischach. 1620, in the village of Fursi David Mozartscher. Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart's great great grandfather was born. 1643, David Mozartscher. Acquires the rights of the citizen of Augsburg. Same year David Mozart sure. marries Maria Nagil. 1647 a David Mozart sure. and Maria Nagil the son, Hans George is born. He will become stone affairs by the master of the Augsburg Episcopate and the chairman of the shop of bricklayers in Augsburg. 1649 a David Mozart sure. And Maria Nagel the son Franz, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart's great-grandfather is born. 1678 David Mozart sure. And his sons Hans and Franz work for Fugarov in their possession. 1679 at Franz Mozart the son, Johann George, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart's grandfather is born. 1681, Franz Mozart moves to live and work in Fuggery. 1718, Johann George Mozart marries the weaver's daughter Anna Maria Salzer. On November 14, 1719, in Present House Museum, Mozart of is born Leopold Mozart, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart's father. 1729-1736, Leopold Mozart gets the general and music education in St. Salvatore's Board in Augsburg. 1737, Leopold Mozart registers the student in the Salzburg University. 1739, Leopold Mozart leaves the Salzburg University and becomes court the Archbishop of Salzburg. 1747, Leopold Mozart becomes the court musician of the Archbishop of Salzburg. Same year he marries Anna Maria Pertel. 1747, Leopold Mozart sends the application on preservation of the rights of the citizen of Augsburg behind him. He will repeat the same application in 1751. 1751, Maria Nannerl, elder sister of Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart, is born. On January 27, 1756, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart's birth. 1756, in Augsburg the well-known textbook of playing Leopold Mozart's violin is printed. 1763, family Mozart of during the travel across Europe stays 15 days in Augsburg. November 1766, family Mozart of stays several days in Augsburg. October 1777, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart stays 15 days in Augsburg. A 
affair with the cousin Anna Basil. 1781 Family Mozart of visits Augsburg. 1782 Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart marries Constantius of Weber. 1787 In Salzburg, the Archbishop's vice conductor Leopold Mozart dies. 1790 On the way back, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart does a stop in Augsburg of Frankfurt. On December 5, 1791, in Vienna, Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart dies of fever. 1841, Basil Cousin dies in Bayreuth. 1858, on the house in which Leopold Mozart was born to the address Francis de Rastorti, the memorial plate in honor of this event appears. 1937, on Francis de Rastorti, Leopold Mozart's house museum opens. 1965, Carolina Grau, the last representative of the sort Mozart in Augsburg dies. The memorable places of Augsburg connected with Mozartomy include houses in which lived Mozart, hotels at which they stayed, churches and other places which they visited. Iris Faffinson 24 The house to this address, near the main Augsburg Cathedral, belonged once to Hans George Mozart, the master of architecture of Baroque and the predecessor of the great composer. The memorial plate on this building reminds of it. Alte Silberschmied. The city of handicraftsmen, it seems, hasn't a direct bearing on Mozartum. None of them here never lived. But guides nevertheless always visit this romantic corner of old Augsburg. The matter is that in Augsburg there is no more place where it would be possible to feel the atmosphere of the 17-18 centuries with such completeness and visual distinctness of feelings. Barthier Kirk In this church located near the town hall, on October 13, 1777 Mozart together with the cousin Anna who was romantically fallen in love with him played on the organ. Here in 1756 the new body of work of the Augsburg master Johann Stein was established. Mozart's father recommending to try the hand on a musical instrument which quality he admired advised to visit Stein on a visit. Baron Tanz this ancient pothouse receives guests since 1572 in a craft part of Augsburg. In October 1777 there were Mozart and the cousin Anna here. Like. Since 1577 there is a pothouse here. In four centuries there were both Mozart and artists Bergmeier and Holbein and the architect Elias Hall and the engineer Rudolf Diesel, and the playwright Bertolt Brecht, and the football player Franz Beckenbauer here. And it is only a part of much more extensive list. Dom. 16 representatives of a sort Augsburg Mozart of were christened in the main city cathedral. And among them, all eight sisters of Leopold Mozart. Hans George Mozart worked stone affairs by the master in Dom Capital. The architect performed function in those days of both the architect and the engineer, and the foreman saw this combination and was meant in definition, stone the master put. Leopold Mozart, besides, sang in church choir of Dom Capital. This chorus of boys and now accompanies every Saturday services in the house. Fraunhof Frankhof, the beautiful area between the house and the residence of the Archbishop. Mozartum is delivered to the father and the son a monument here. Every year in July here in the open air there take place Mozart musical representations. 
this very romantic show and the stars and a high tower of the residence in which the Emperor Maximilian I posed for Albrecht Durer. First Bischoflick Residence The residence of the Archbishop took the present form in the middle of the 18th century so here it is easy to present the atmosphere of Mozart times. In July Mozart holidays in bad weather of representation are transferred to Rococo so anyway the 18th century is guaranteed. Fujeri the oldest social settlement of the world is founded by Jacob Fugger in 1521. In Fugger A there lived with the family Mozart Franz's great-grandfather Mozart. He was stone affairs by the master in this stifting. On Mittlergast 14 in Fugger A there is in this respect a memorial plate. After Franz Mozart's death his family remained in Fugger A only moved to other house on the same street in number 22. Fuggerhauser Five days later after Leopold Mozart's birth his granduncle Hans George Mozart died. A master of architecture of Baroque, Hans George made for improvement of various palaces Fugger of much. In 1511 Jacob Fugger Bogarty bought the extensive site on the central street of the imperial city of Augsburg, present Maximilianstrasse. He planned having united several courtyards, to create the extensive personal estate in the center of urban development. Jacob Fugger and his successors received in Augsburg guests of honor, in the rank of kings and emperors. Among them, for example, there were Emperors Maximilian I and Charles V. The Palace Fugarov on scope had to be worthy guests of such rank. So works Fugarov for architects and had enough stone affairs of masters from the very beginning of the 16th century. And palaces Fugarov in other cities periodically demanded the palace in Augsburg updating repair. There were new styles, the fashion changed, and palaces then had to be reconstructed sometimes completely. In the Augsburg Fugger of Mozart Palace on October 22, 1777 I gave an open concert. The concert hall in which Wolf played for public didn't remain. He was in the part of the building which adjoins to the weapon house now and subsequently was reconstructed. Goldener Saal. The gold hall of the town hall of Augsburg, height to three floors and with three rows of magnificent windows, was always the place of receptions. The family Mozart have visited the gold hall only once. In 1763. Georgskirk. The men's choir of Church of St. George arose in 1070. But the church about which the speech will go was constructed much later in 1505. To this church a sort Augsburg Mozart of was attributed since the 17th century. David Mozart, the third, David son Mozart II and David Mozart III grandson who went at first in Franciscan priests, and then in monks, served in this church since 1686. And before different Mozart, both namesakes, and relatives, years honored as entered dicks of the Catholic community at St. George's Church. Hans George Mozart, the most successful and successful of Augsburg Mozart of, built in 1702-1705 for St. George's Church the building of community. In this church Leopold Mozart was baptized and Leopold's father concluded the second marriage with future mother of Leopold, Anna Maria Salzer here. Pilot Kruiskirchen in Augsburg known for the toleration, two Holy Cross churches also stand a nearby. 
Catholic and Lutheran. In chorus of boys of Catholic Church, Leopold Mozart sang once. For old times' sake, he recommended to the son not to forget to come at visit of Augsburg and to Holy Cross Church and to play there on body. However, it was talked not of entertainment and not of memoirs. A game on different bodies, certainly of high quality, perfectly trained musicians who should play often on the organ as obliges. In Holy Cross Church, just there was also a good body. The father and Mozart's son always were welcome guests here. Music both Mozart have decorated performances of men's choir of church and the monastery. The notes waited as well as demonstration performances here. Hexenbrunnen. This wooden sculpture of the witch on a city wall near Fishgate, apparently, has no relation to Mozartum. She appeared here only in 1959. Here the unfortunate women who were once sentenced to burning the last time in the life drank water from a well. But organizers of Mozart excursions steadily include a visit to Hexenbrunnen in the roots. They want to remind that Augsburg of times of Leopold Mozart was not such the quiet and cultural town as it can seem in the court garden. When Leopold was a boy, in Augsburg still there took place processes on a charge of sorcery. Hofgarten The court garden at the residence of the Archbishop arose in 1740. The walls protecting from city noise the strict architecture of bushes, flower beds and trees, sculptures and a graceful pond in the middle turned the court garden into the elite place of an era of Rococo. Hotel Bray Morin Three Moors, the most expensive hotel of Augsburg. His full name since the 15th century, Zudan Dre Morin with his mute, to three moors. Once it was the part of the extensive residence Fugarov on the main street of Augsburg. The strange name of hotel is connected with a legend of visit of the city by three black monks from Christian Abyssinia. In 1763 here for two weeks Leopold Mozart with family stopped. For these two weeks Leopold Mozart paid three monthly salaries. He solved considered these expenditure as investments into the rating, expecting to return everything at the expense of orders for concerts from rich clients. The fact of sale of tickets for concerts directly had to play in the most prestigious hotel of the city, as envisioned by Leopold, a big role for local rich men. But I didn't play. Collecting was very small. In 1766, on the way back from Paris of Mozart, I stopped here only for one night. The hotel building, by the way, already not that was at the time of Mozart. How damaged during bombings of 1944, it was built after war almost anew. In the spirit of old times, the facade and partially the fire, but all the rest, a remake was restored. Kleiner Goldener Saal. The Lane of Jesuits played a big role Leopold Mozart's lives. Since four years he attended School of Jesuits, having passed then into a gymnasium which it is successful in 17 years and ended. Also the school hall in which he many times acted as a part of Gymnasia Children's Theatre was well familiar to him. His school hall disappeared long ago, and his place was taken by magnificently decorated small gold hall of board of Jesuits decorated in style of Rococo by Matthias Giuntas's frescoes. Every year in May the small gold hall becomes the center of Mozart holidays in Augsburg. 
its acoustics especially intended for chamber concerts, and registration of the hall returns the audience at the time of younger Mozart. Leopold Mozart Conservatorium The music school founded in 1873 and 1926 was transformed to City Conservatory. The conservatory often moved until in 1956 it stopped at last on Maximilienstrasse 59. They passed 40 more years, and on the building the memorial plate appeared. Now here traditional violin competitions of Leopold Mozart are held. Maximilienstrasse Plovnaya Street of Augsburg as any other place in the city, is full of memories of Mozart times. The family Mozart have stayed in Three Moors Hotel. In the Fugarov Palace the family Mozart have gave concerts. The family Mozart have visited a basilica of Saints Ulrich and Afra. The family Mozart have considered the house of the Master Stein doing excellent bodies almost native. The water at Town Hall Square is connected with a name of Mozart repeatedly. World War II at the corner of Town Hall Square was faced by the massive old St. Petersburg Stock Exchange which isn't restored after war. The exchange was adjoined by the building of Nobility Assembly in which in 1777 younger Mozart gave a concert for patricians of the city. Whether you still love Tara Michelle. Mozart wrote in the letter to the cousin. This holiday and in the 18th century was celebrated in the same way as now, on September 29. Tepenkist. Hans George Moser participated in reorganization of the building of Hospital of the Holy Spirit in which there is a theater of puppets now once. And the theater didn't disregard a name in Mozart's affairs. In the repertoire of theater of puppets two comic doll performances for adults. Small magic flute and small kite to a seraglio. Chelsea Palais. The palace of the banker and dealer in silver Libert von Liberkofen arose from the reconstructed building between 1756 and 1770, and hasn't a direct bearing on Mozartum. But perfectly shows spirit and style of an era of Rococo. Therefore in the hall of Rococo of the Banking Palace annually in May there take place chamber concerts of Mozart festivals. Steinsch's One House At Ulrich Square in the house at number 10 there lived the master of music Johann Stein. The house in which he lived is built in the 16th century. He did such fine bodies and claviers that behind them registered in turn for the years ahead. Johann Stein was the closest bosom friend of Leopold Mozart, and in his house all Mozart were repeatedly and were always met as the family. The expert on the latest inventions of the Vienna mechanics, Stein was able to do everything the technologies of his time allowed. Being skeptical about musical abilities of most of the ordinary visitors, the master was always glad to provide to Wolf Mozart the bodies and claviers for tests. In 1777 Mozart worked in Stein's house much, testing one tool behind another. He asked to send in the best clavier of Stein. Ulrich's Basilica a Catholic Basilica of Saints Ulrich and Afra, the second most important and to the size is the sacral building of Augsburg after the house. He a little Leopold Mozart sang once in church choir. 
Nowadays not existing monastery at Mozart's Basilica was visited for survey of church treasures more than once. On the body of a basilica constructed at the expense of Jacob Fugger in 1580 and 1777 younger Mozart played for friends of the father what the memorial plate reminds visitors now. Weaslam the younger Mozart and his mother lived two weeks in White Lamb Hotel in 1777, from October 11 to October 26. Once again Mozart stopped here in 1790, coming back from Paris. Now there is no White Lamb. There was only a memorial plate with the solemn list of the famous visitors. Zeigarnhaus Mozart on Krapost Moval Street at number 25 there is a house which belonged still quite recently to the last representatives living in Augsburg of Mozart. Carolina Mozart owned him before the most death in 1965. The biggest stadium in Augsburg, Rosenau Stadium. On M32000 places almost all under the open sky. Under a roof during a rain only 1300 fans can take cover. Other large stadiums, closed and it is significantly less by the sizes. In the Augsburg Sport Call, from 3200 to 4500 places. At Winter Stadium of Kurt Franz Alia minus 7000. In 2009 in Union Football Stadium, Impulse Arena, on, places renamed in 2011 into, Sol the Arena was constructed. Famous Teams The football club Augsburg, representing the city in Bundesliga and ice hockey team Augsburger Panther, which plays in the German Hockey League. In the city of 50 football fields. It is necessary to add 60 gyms, 70 sports grounds to them in the open air, 10 outdoor and indoor pools. From, residents of Augsburg anyway play sports 75000. So many people are signed up in various sports societies or use constant subscriptions for visit of gyms. This more than a quarter of the population of the city. 20 years ago among those someone play physical culture and sports in Augsburg the decisive overweight was on the party of men. They were twice more than women. And now only in one and a half. If this trend remains, then in 10 years the number of men and women among active athletes will even up. Athletes from Augsburg repeatedly participated at the Summer Olympic Games and became on them prize winners. In 1932 in Los Angeles Rudolphus Mayer won gold among weightlifters of average weight. In 1936 at the Berlin Olympic Games Rudolphus Mayer became the silver prize winner. He was the leader of the German team and said the Olympic Ove. After Warris Mayer was a member of City Council of Augsburg. Miss Mayer died in 1998 at the age of nearly 100 years. In 1960 in Rima Heidi Schmidt won gold in fencing on rapiers. At the next Olympic Games in Tokyo Heidi Schmidt became the bronze prize winner. In 1972 at the Munich Olympic Games Gisela Gracias won silver in rowing on canoes single. In 1984 at the Olympic Games in Los Angeles Erhard Wunderlich became the silver prize winner as a part of handball team and Dieter Weidmann won gold on the canoe pair. In 1988 in Seoul Roland Grack Hammer became the bronze prize winner as a part of the soccer team. 
in 1992 in Barcelona in competitions on the canoe single Elizabeth Mikeller won gold. In 1996 in Atlanta Oliver Fix won gold on the canoe single, and Andrea Sirenberg bronze on the canoe pair. In 2000 in Sydney Thomas Schmidt became the Olympic champion on the canoe single. In 1979 in the city there took place the Junior World Figure Skating Championship. Economy Augsburg, the large scientific and industrial center. Here the plant Siemens, Messerschmitt, Mann and others are located. Avog Holding AD, one of the famous European trade groups which main field of activity or cause. 24 trade enterprises in Germany and 11 beyond her limits. Croatia, Hungary, Poland and Austria. Located in 106 places make a basis of firm. Her general representation is in Augsburg. Avog not only trades in cars, but also carries out their maintenance. Turnover of firm exceeds 1 billion euros, sales make about 7000 cars a year, and the personnel of Avog in Europe total 2500 employees. Augsburg Airways, Regional Office of Concern, whose center is in the city of Holbermoos, close to Munich. The enterprise was founded in 1980 as service of air transport of Heindel Concern, under the name of Interat Airways. Then cargo flights to Dusseldorf and back were the main air route of the company. In six years of Interat Airways mastered also civil flights along the same route. In 1995 Interot Airways entered the Otta Association of Air Carriers. In two years the company changed a name for Augsburg Airways and joined the ranks of partners of Lufthansa, and her planes were painted in colors of the general partner. Anton Ballmann Song Musical Publishing House with Very Long Traditions the publishing house specializes in Catholic Church music, and is founded in 1803 by Andreas Bohm, whose son and the successor, Anton Bayem, also named firm. This enterprise is family also now, and its current owners, the sixth generation of publishers. Generally the publishing house publishes now choral music because church choirs in Germany is set, and demand for qualitative editions is steady. At the same time, the publishing house sells also different musical accessories. Augsburger Actin Bank, one of the oldest direct banking of Germany. It is founded in 1963. The bank isn't among large, but has good reputation. As all direct banking, Augsburger Actin Bank has no branches. Specialization of bank and investment to real estate and financial service. The bank carries the present name since 1986, and before it was called up credit. Five years since 1997 on 2002, Augsburger Actin Bank was a part of Allianz Concern, but in 2002 Allianz was sold by Augsburger Actin Bank of other insurance company, Evli Versicheren. Todd clients use services of Augsburger Actin Bank. Better Farm Osna Mittel, the pharmacological enterprise founded in Augsburg in 1993. Specialization of Better Farm, the drugs which are released without recipe and in this sphere the Augsburg firm takes in Germany the leading positions, first of all in cardiology and neurology. In 2004 the firm stopped being the independent enterprise. It was bought by British from International Concern Drive. Redis and a part of laboratories is located in the Indian city of Hyderabad now. 
nevertheless an assortment better farm about 150 active ingredients for more than 900 dosage forms. In recent years Better Farm actively develops the offers in the field of sedatives. Brauhaus Regal, one of the leading brewing enterprises of Bavaria. Regal, some Golden and Rowe Brewery founded in 1884 by Sebastian. Conducts the family tree since 1386 when Sebastian's ancestors opened a pothouse. Affairs Regal went uphill, and in 1911 he constructed for a brewery the new plant near Augsburg. Same year the architect Hans Schnell near Konigsplatz constructed Regales in the style which united lines of a modernist style and neo-baroque. Brauhaus Regal remains family business also now. In a year the brewery fills card bottles. It gives work to 100 employees and a turnover of 18 million euros. In Kurtzkofena at Regal the Logistics Centrum. It especially is necessary because Brauhaus Regal produces not only beer, but also mineral water and lemonade. The average term of stay of guests in Augsburg minus 1.7 days. Augsburg at all quantity of sites belongs to a class of the tourist cities, stay in which is limited, as a rule, to short survey within one two days. A considerable part of guests who stay in hotels of Augsburg belongs not to tourists, and to those someone visit the city with a business visit or visits relatives. In Augsburg 40 hotels and hotels. It is less than a half of big hotels of them minus 16. Hotels of the middle class minus 14, hotels of lower class 10. At the same time in all hotels and hotels of the city 3500 guests can accommodate. 2150 from them the others can stay in big hotels and in other vacation spots. To Augsburg annually there come card guests. It is more than inhabitants in Augsburg. Card of visitors from card stay in big hotels. The economy of Augsburg in many respects depends on successful capital flow, development of new technologies, broad international contacts. Achievement of these purposes is impossible without exhibitions of goods and technologies, work of numerous public associations. The New Augsburg Exhibition Center, Messezentrum, is in the southern part of the city, near the university. He serves not only for regional exhibitions and the congresses, but also for events of the all-European value. At the same time he can accept up to 80 hundred visitors. Messezentrum is very conveniently located. Near him, federal B and A highways, lines of trams, city and intercity buses. Twelve showrooms Messezentrum have the total area of 57000 M. 18000 more M. Occupy the free spaces which are built in the general very tectonics of the project. 3500 M. Occupies the modern conference hall with numerous places for guests of the various international and federal congresses. Ath abbreviation is familiar to many residents and guests of Augsburg. This designation of the most popular of annual exhibitions, Augsburger Friger Sostelung. One more abbreviation, well familiar for Augsburgsatz, CIA. This designation of a public initiative city, Initiative Augsburg. She combines efforts of all someone are interested in development of the city. 
is a part of Association 234 Dicks from all main areas of life of Augsburg. Industries, Trade, Massachusetts Media, Cultural and Public Associations. A main objective of association, development of the downtown. An instead. My, the association dealing with issues of economic development of the southern Germany. This region in the context of uniform Europe is capable to occupy one of the leading positions in processes of the all-European economic integration. Efforts of 114 dicks of association are directed to creation of the general programs for the southern Germany. One more association which efforts are aimed at the development of Augsburg, Augsburg AD. It is created in July, 2003. Participants of this society are engaged in creation and implementation of uniform programs of import and export of the Augsburg economy in the territory of Germany and the European Union. Successful attraction in city economy of the capitals from other regions and export of the Augsburg capitals, a main goal of association. Ecology Within the city there are a lot of trees and flowers, there is a large botanical garden. In 1997 Augsburg won a competition on the most green city in which nine European countries participated. Very powerful contribution to purity of air is made also by a well-organized network of city passenger transport saving the city from considerable number of personal cars. Through them on entries into the city from highways the intercepting parking from which it is possible to reach any place quickly by public transport, bus and tram are organized. In February, 1996 Augsburg entered into alliance of the European cities of Agenda-21. Purpose of the Union To develop the system of the ecological measures conforming to requirements of the 21st century in industrially developed cities. The share of concrete responsibility for success of these measures was undertaken not only city government and city council, but also practically all large public, professional and church organizations. Within the Convention on Decrease in Emission in the Atmosphere of Carbon Monoxide in Augsburg more than 70 events, including with participation of management of transport, the industrial unions, construction organizations are held. In Augsburg, the project, known in all Germany, functions. An information system on control over noise and air pollution. Noise of transport, industrial productions and even shops in places of sport and leisure is estimated on a special scale, and these data are collected from all city. In the most noisy places. Platz, Karl Strassi, Borgesplitz, J.M. Thicker strays, free bristress, is special measuring stations. On conic plats also the content in air of heavy metals is in addition measured. For the last 10 years this indicator decreased from 130 to 105 units. Data which are obtained from measuring stations form a basis for development of programs for fight against noise and air pollution. The water supply system of Augsburg is calculated on service of car people, the city and adjacent settlements. In 10 years water consumption in the city decreased from car to car dam. In day, it occurred for two reasons. Implementation of new technologies and programs of economy of water. Decrease in consumption, in turn, reduces load of the systems of purification of the polluted water which is missing annually 21 million cubic meters.
a system of separate collecting waste allowed to increase in recent years sharply not only cost efficiency of waste recycling, but also level of environmental safety of this process. The number of desorted waste going for a specialized processing grew by 50, 100%, and the quantity of the remains decreased in 10 years from car to 45000 tons. The region of Augsburg is located in the center of Europe, and the major pass through automobile and the railroads. Total length of roads of the region of Augsburg minus 2700 came, on them pass every year 78 million people. This figure is almost equal to the population of Germany. In Munich, Stuttgart Autobahn, with high-speed road BB and federal roads of BNB, the most important highways of the Augsburg region. The high-speed railroad Munich Stuttgart connects not only these two cities, but also Munich with Nuremberg. Through the region of Augsburg also the road Paris, Budapest, lying through Strasbourg, Karlsruhe, Stuttgart, Munich, Linz and Vienna runs. The regional airport of Augsburg lies in one and a half kilometers to the north of the city. Now the question of its closing in connection with close location of Munich minus two airport is discussed. In Augsburg five tram and 27 bus routes. Also there are night buses duplicating some main flights to time off. In plans of the city government, one more tram route. The regional transport network consists of four railway routes and the 101st bus line. The industrial enterprises are serviced by private network of the cargo railroads. On it nearly, tons of freights are annually transported. The rationalism of transportations is provided by the modern program of logistics. In the next plans, merging of cargo roads of the Augsburg region to network with uniform management. It is for this purpose planned to construct the center of messages about 100 hectares, directly near Autobahn A, and then to connect him to the route augsburg Donavjord. The tram in Augsburg appeared in 1881. Then still horse. On June 1, 1898 in the city the movement of the electric tram continuing to this day began. The tram network created by the beginning of the 1930th years underwent an insignificant loss in the 50s, having lost several minor routes. In the 60th, the 80th years of the last century the condition of the Augsburg tram system was very stable, the rolling stock was regularly updated. In the 90s construction of new lines and extension of existing began. At the beginning of the 21st century process was again slowed down because of the all-European economic crisis though projects are still actively developed. The interval of the movement of tram transport of the working days. From 6.30 till 18.30. Makes 5 minutes, on Saturdays minus 10 minutes, and on holidays and Sundays minus 15 minutes. All network of Augsburg is serviced by one tram depot. The second. Historically, the first. The depot is used as a workshop and storage of the museum equipment. The rolling stock in the city is quite diverse. The main part of the tram park is made by the modern low floor combino and city flex. Bombardier flex city outlook, which are gradually replacing old cars with the high level of a floor. The special sliding board for wheelchairs, which is in addition facilitating entrance departure from the car, is provided in new trams. The Scottish city of Inverness became the first twin city in 1956. 
in Inverness now 45000 inhabitants. As well as Augsburg Inverness, the centre of the district. In this city there is a lock in which there lived Macbeth. In 1959, Augsburg made friends with two Japanese cities at once. Nagakama and Amagasaki. In Nagakam card inhabitants, and this city, one of the main tourist centers of Japan. Tourists are attracted by both well remain medieval center and ancient Buddhist temples. Amagasaki is more than Augsburg here card inhabitants. The city, as well as Augsburg, was strongly destroyed during World War II, and then is restored. The American Dayton, the state of Ohio, the USA became the following twin city in 1959. The live card people. The city is called in honor of the Captain Jonathan Dayton who became famous during the War of Independence. In Dayton there is a university, known in the USA. In 1967 the French city of Burrs joined four Augsburg Swarm Brothers. In this ancient city of 70000 inhabitants, and he, as well as Augsburg, the center of the Catholic Archbishopric. Burrs cathedrals are entered in the special security list of UNESCO. In 2001, Augsburg made friends with the Czech city of Liberec. In Liberca, about card inhabitants. The city is the large district center of Bohemia. It isn't less historical monuments in Liberca than in Augsburg. The last, seventh twin city, there was for Augsburg in 2004 the Chinese Jinan. In Jinan, six million inhabitants. Once Jinan was the capital of Aung Kingdom, and since then in the city numerous historical monuments remained. Also far. Write comments. Read comments. Interesting people will tell interesting stories. All of good mood and good luck.